singers. It's been a while since we have visited grannies and granddads. We're returning to it with this interesting picture that I've drawn on the board. The first two lines that you sing in the song have the exact same set of words and the same rhythm. And there's also something else that is almost the same. Listen to me as I sing these two lines. Even if you remember them, I want you just to listen this time. Here I go, oh you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Second line, oh you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Can you tell what is very close to exactly the same? It's the melody, the ups and the downs. That is actually called the contour. I have written these words in their contour. When the notes are going up, the word, the word or the piece of the word is written higher. When the notes are going down, the words are written lower. Um, and again, that's called contour, the ups and the downs of the melody. <clears throat> Can you tell that there is, this melody stays the same most of the way through these two phrases? What word, is the place where that contour changes. At what word? I'll give you a minute. If you said the word now, you are correct. The first time through, the now is lower. It's actually below this line that I've written, that or that I've drawn. This line is the line where do is. Anytime you see a word that's written right on top of that line, that means we're singing do. Do, 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 do. That's our home base. This now is so low that it's actually below do. So I'm gonna circle it. Hope that that red shows up. My red is running out of ink. And I'm gonna draw an arrow pointing down because that is gonna help us remember that we sing that now down. The second time after the word dads, now is higher. So we're gonna draw an arrow going up. I'm going to sing these two lines again. I want you to listen this time as well. And when we get to that word now, either point down or up, depending on which one we're singing. Here I go, oh you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Oh you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Have you noticed that when the now goes down, the Lord also goes down. And when now goes up, the Lord also goes up. That's a really easy way to remember the contour of the ends of these phrases. Let's go back to the beginning and this time, would you sing along with me and point down for now and the Lord and then up for now and the Lord when appropriate. Here we go, oh you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Oh, I forgot to point down for the Lord. Oh you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. That's it. Again, that the ups and the downs of the melody are called the contour, and that is your first code word contour. I'm going to write that down here so that you know how to spell it. Contour. There you go. <clears throat> and now we're going to do something a little bit different with this. Every time we have this, um, this rest, it is following an S. Bless and bless. What, we'll be, what we will be tempted to do is make that S really loud, and we do not want that to happen. We want it to be very tiny and very precise, like this. Bless, bless, bless. Try that with me. Bless, bless, bless. We want to be able to hear the rest of the word more than we hear the S of the bless. <laughs> um, what we want to do there also is have bless the Lord. Have a nice big D at the end of Lord. Does this sound familiar? I 
feel like we practiced the exact same thing in another song. Hmm. Bless the Lord. Sing that for me. Here we go. Bless the Lord. Listen to this one. Bless the Lord. Your turn. Bless the Lord. Good. Now we're going back to the beginning and we've got three things to do at the end. We're gonna show pointing down or up for now. And then we're going to show the s and the d at the end of bless and Lord. Let's try it. Here we go. Oh, your fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Next line. Oh, your fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Good. We're going to do one last thing with this song, and that is a couple super important consonants. Oh, you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads. The beginning of each of those words, father, fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads. We are going to make those the most important sounds. Would you say fathers, mm, mothers, G, grannies, G, granddads. Then when we sing it, we want, Oh, you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads. Let's try it. Here we go. Oh, you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads. Whew. It makes you work hard, but if every single one of you is pronouncing it just the way I am, we are going to have no problem understanding these words. Say one more time, repeat after me, fathers, mothers, grannies, granddads. Also, ladies and gentlemen, do we pronounce the R in fathers, fathers and mothers? Nope. We don't pronounce the R, so fathers, mothers, you got it. Let's sing it, here we go. Oh, you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Next line. Oh, you fathers and mothers and grannies and granddads, now bless the Lord. Fantastic. There's going to be one other question in your Google form. So I hope you were paying attention to all the things that we were really carefully practicing here. One of those things is gonna show up in your Google form.